A new video released by California Fire shows some of the dramatic tactics being used both in the air and on the ground to battle a series of deadly wildfires. California firefighters have posted some of the pictures of the fire on their Facebook page here. Now, 16 fires continue to threaten thousands of homes in Northern California. And just to give you an idea of how destructive this fire has been, it's actually destroyed an area larger than the city of Los Angeles. And officials say things are only going to get worse before they get better. After receiving a bit of a break from Mother Nature, the National Weather Service says extreme weather conditions are returning. The forecast calling for temperatures to soar above 35 degrees Celsius with extremely low humidity through Saturday. The state's governor is pointing to global warming, predicting that this is just a sign of things to come. We're in a new normal. Uh, we're in a, a drought that uh, will continue. Now, whether you technically call it a drought, uh, that's a matter for the weather people. But I would suspect there'll be more fires to come and uh, more fires each year uh, for a very long time because it's going to be a, a while before we uh, shift the weather back to where it historically was. The raging fire near the city of Reading is being blamed for six deaths and destroying more than 1,500 structures. The blaze began from a small spark from a vehicle that was being towed away. It remains just 35 percent contained and has already scorched an area larger than the city of Denver, making it the sixth most destructive fire in California's history. But firefighters have made some progress. Residents have been allowed to return home in certain spots, or at least to what's left of their homes. In other areas, it's still far too dangerous for evacuation orders to be lifted. What we don't want to do is put people back in their homes that have been evacuated for a week and then have something go bad on the incident where we have to turn around and reevacuate those folks. California has already spent $125 million battling these fires. That's a quarter of what was budgeted, and the state's budget year only began last month.